99.5 V X. <laughs> Pinky out. Very formal interview. Mm -hmm. All right, we are hanging backstage here with American Fangs. You have a, a single out titled Pomona. Correct. And you guys are from Houston, Texas. Yes, sir. He's talking with Ad Rock, your label rep, mm -hmm. and he was talking about a great place to get beef jerky between Houston and Dallas. Are you aware of this place? You know what's up? Is that Bucky's? Yeah, You're talking about Bucky's. He's talking about Bucky's. Yeah. Are you a fan of beef jerky? You guys are on the road. I'm sure your diets aren't necessarily all that healthy. Funny thing is, is that's what I had for breakfast. Yeah, we had beef jerky for breakfast. As soon as we got here, Matador jerky. Yep. Matador and they they hooked it up. It's, it's fitting. It's Matador. You're from Texas. There's a lot of bull riding going on. There out is. There. there is. There is. Cowboy hats. A lot of yeah, places. yeah. I take it you don't see a lot of cowboy hats at your shows. I would hope so. I wish. Yeah, I'm yeah. In, in Houston, we we got a lot of cowboy yeah. family and friends. So yeah, there's some, some cow. You know, oh, sweet cowboys and a rock audience. You got to love it. Yep. Now, uh, you guys are the first band to play today on the Jägermeister stage. It's wet out there. It's nasty. How did uh, how did it go for you? Perfect. Awesome. Couldn't have gone any better. Yeah, even wet and nasty. Yeah, but well, we were gonna end up that way anyway. Because that's how we get down. We but, just get wet and nasty. Cool. Being the opening band, any opening band, all of them out there, they know what it's like. You're the sore oh, yeah. thumb, you're a worm on a big hook, and everybody just moseyed on over to the Jägermeister stage, and the Jägermeister crew, they were freaking hilarious, cutting it up with us the whole morning, and uh, and we actually got to play, and that's all. That's what we were here for. So. Hell yeah, hell yeah. Well, you know what? The fans deserve it. They're standing out there. They're wet. They're drenched. Yeah. They're in ponchos and garbage Absolutely. bags and everything. They're muddy. Yeah, yeah. And all they, I wanted was they were just play. Just so somebody play. You know. And we were giving them a countdown, like five we were like minutes, five or minutes, minutes, and they're four like, minutes. Oh, and, <laughs> and they were so hype, and it was cool. And we were feeding off of that. So no matter rain, snow, I, I was kind of hoping I got struck by lightning, because I and, and lived. And, and live was a big part of that. Skin melted off part. because it, I, I mean we'd be huge. It's no hard. To, what. It's hard to stay wet and nasty if you're. Yeah. You know if you're not alive. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. But you can be wet and nasty and dead too. But yeah. Yeah. That's a bummer. You know it's it's craziness. Honestly, it is a, it is an interesting vibe out here at Rebellion today with the weather and, and whatnot. Uh, but I'm curious to know you guys have you have crazy sense of humor. Yes. You got just meet you, you guys. Know? Well, I mean, because we're talking about all these. Th different things. Yeah, yeah. Beef cool. jerky, uh, ranging from beef jerky to uh, the very formal pink, pinky out interview. Correct, correct. Uh, to uh, to grammar, so. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's, it's one of these things, what do you guys do when you're out there, when you're touring, you, you know, you're, you're ground pounding, you're doing all this stuff, getting the name out there. What keeps you guys sane on the road? Laughter. Man, Laughter. we like to have fun. Uh, we got a lot of family back home that love us, so that's a good, like, you know, good building block. And we, you know, we're all brothers, so that brotherhood, you know, when we're out, whether it be waking up in the morning, going for a run, you know, we're just kicking it during the day, writing music, talking, throwing stuff at each other, shaving an eyebrow, you know, <laughs> who knows what it is, but, you know, it's just like that, it's that brotherhood com com camaraderie that, you know, we all got, and it's just like that, that, you know, it keeps you laughing from. So is there at least one member of the band that has a shaved? Eyebrow at I think all we've times. All probably had something yeah, we've like all that. had one. Somebody's got freaking piss think, jump, dumped on them. I think it's somebody actually bad. drank <laughs> a bottle of piss yeah. thinking it was water the other day. Yeah, yeah. And it was purposely planned, so. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, so one thing to know about American Fangs is you always have to be on your toes. You yes, do. be sharp, remain and aware. They don't leave any razors for the eyebrows. You yeah, know, yeah. You leave a razor laying behind you, it's just, you kind of ask for it, so. Yeah. Our motto, you got to be preemptive strike. You got to get people for what they're going to do to you in the future. So just get them. I mean, they're smiling, but there's something going on back there. Is that how you'd classify your sound? A preemptive strike? The preemptive strike. Well, I mean, nobody sees us coming. We're, you know, we don't look down on gimmicks whatsoever. Anything like music and performing is to be absorbed and enjoyed. We just happen to do it our way. We're, we wear a combination of like ratty tatty clothes and, and we just like to sweat and just jam and that's what like rock and roll has always been to us. And, and that's, that's what we do. It's a trashy, poppy, catchy shit. Knock it out, man. Knock it out. I, I really appreciate your time, guys. You got it, man. Thank you. And uh, if there's one thing you need to look out for from American Fangs, be listening for Pomona, the single out now. And what's the album title? May 14th, Street Date.
Street Day. Yeah, Street Date is the May 14th self-titled American Fangs album. That's when it's coming out. You got it. Look out for them.